the way this thing works is is really simple. Uh, I've got a PC223 brass here that I've balanced on a ruler and I colored the back half of it and that's because where the permanent marker begins on the shell is actually the center of gravity for the shell. That's where it balances. And this is how these loaders work. Basically, um, I've got the hole right here. This is actually shorter than the front half of the piece of brass and so that way when this sits in the notch as it gets brought up it'll actually just sit there as it spins by and the brass will continue basically until the black edge of the permanent marker hits the edge of the hole this thing will not tip and fall in but since this distance here in the plastic opening is less than the front brass it causes the neck of the brass to pass the opening before it falls in. So if it's going this direction, the back end of the, the brass is going to fall down the hole first. Now obviously, if it's going this way, and I have to hold it in here, if it feeds it up this direction in here, as you can see, it's going to fall in the hole right away because the back end of the brass fits down the hole right off the bat. So if I grab that piece of brass on the bucket, I can go ahead and show you this by turning it on. I'm dropping it again, almost. So basically right now it's just sitting there and if I turn this on you'll see once that black part of the brass hits the hole, it, the front neck of the brass will have passed the hole and the back end will fall down first. Really simple. So now just to convey my point, I'm going to show you what happens if it's going the other direction. If it feeds up backwards, it just falls in right away. And then if I go ahead and grab it wherever it went, up there, up there. And I go ahead and put it in the second way. It'll feed up, pass a hole, back end falls down. That's simple.